Hey what's up there YouTube, I have a whole new video for you guys on how to play Game Boy Advance games on your Android device or tablet. Alright, so the first thing you wanna gonna the first thing you're gonna wanna do is go into your market and download the app for shared. After doing that, you're gonna want to go to where you have your apps, find for shared in the app tray Let's see if we can find it here for sure there we have it gonna go, wanna go into the app tray find for shared and type in the app slide me After doing that, click search, pretty self-explanatory. And then what you're going to want to do is click on Slimy Marketplace. Now, Slimy Marketplace is a third-party marketplace in, re in place of the Android market. I usually don't like third-party apps or anything, but this definitely works. Now, when you get to it, it's going to make you wait 20 seconds, and our 20 seconds is already up. You're going to want to click here to download file. should pop up, or click it again. Download started. Now, you're going to wait for that to download, and it's already completed. Simple as that. Okay, you're going to want to click all the agreements, install, and there we have it installed just like that now let's open this baby up now you see you have all these options for apps some of them are free some of them are not the app we are getting is free what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go here click search and search GBA and click go. <clears throat> now you can see you have Game Boy. That's the one that you play the apps on, which you will download. And you have emulator ROMs. You will download that as well. So download Game Boy. Click everything, install, and then you'll have it there. And then you want to download emulator ROMs this is how you get games you do need this well you don't need it you can also get ROMs from the computer by going to coolrom.com putting it into a folder and playing it that way okay so you're gonna wanna install that as well I have it installed both free now before you can play any apps you need uh, the GBA BIOS.bin now what that is, it's just something that allows you to play it. See, I have it right here. To get that, you're going to want to go back to Foreshared. Go here, type in GBA BIOS, and then search. Now you can see there are two at the very top and you got one from two years ago. I wouldn't recommend downloading it just because it's old. I would get the one from six months ago. Download that. Oops, sorry. I accidentally hit the camera. Download that and you should be good. Now what you're going to want to do is get ROMs. You're going to want to open your Game Boy Advance emulator app and find a ROM that you want. Click OK to advertisements. And let's see. What you're going to want to do is click that, what I just did. Go to download ROMs. Let's see. The ROM I was trying was Supersonic Warriors, but I'll show you what it's like from here. You will click the Game Boy Advance ROM, since that's what you will likely want and find a game that you want like I did 
I did Supersonic Warriors, but I will do a different one, too, so it has to reinstall all over again. And let's see, what do we want? Oh, the Legacy of Goku. Fun game, it's like Boo's Fury. Click download, and it should download relatively fast. There we have it. It is downloaded. Oops, that's the ringer. I do not want that up. We'll click play. It should play automatically. And there we have it. The Legacy of Goku. Click English. And then there's proof that it is working. Let's press start, new game, yada yada yada, all this fancy fancy stuff. And that is how you play games on your Android device. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, be free, feel free to comment below or message me personally. And I will try and help you out to the best of my ability. My name is Ben, and I'm out of here. Thanks, guys. Peace.